with a 60-plus Vespa scooters out on the open road. They're going through town as part of an eight-day ride across the U.S. from Georgia to California. K-Texas photojournalist Dan Crowley caught up with them this afternoon. We got everything from big modern Vespas to 70s Vespas like mine. Always had scooters, always had smaller displacement vehicles, and never really found a problem getting anywhere on them. So the idea of riding cross country, it was like, yeah, I want to do that. It's just that most people, you know, kind of scoff at the idea that it's even possible. Almost. It's pretty much a bigger people who will all do anything, keep everyone's bikes running, make sure they'll make it to the finish. And it's about the best camaraderie you're ever going to find around a group of people ever. Small bikes are a lot of fun. I've ridden just about everything you can imagine, and this is my daily rider that I ride to work almost every day. Everybody's going to come away from it knowing their bike way better than they ever knew before, because you're always going to push it beyond where you've ever pushed it. <laughs> how about that? They're on, uh, I don't know how many miles this is, but their next leg between Abilene and Roswell, New Mexico, is 326 miles. That's a lot of, I think I saw one stretch was 396. That's a lot of riding. Well, they're spending the night in Abilene. Oh, like Welcome, Vesper riders. Yeah. Welcome. Okay, Mike Scow, big night tomorrow night. For